All right, let's go ahead and test this boy. You been drinking, sir? <laughs> welcome back to the channel welcome back so to another lspdf tutorial so guys right. today we're gonna go ahead yeah, and replace whatever. the breathalyzer we're gonna i would say let's just go ahead and install a breathalyzer instead instead of replacing it we're just gonna go ahead and install it so right now what i have is a default so let's go ahead and check this guy uh and see if he's uh drinking at work all right let me go ahead and change the view so that you can see what the default it looks like it's like an inhaler or something all right so let me go ahead and go to a breathalyzer test and then i'm gonna go ahead and perform a breathalyzer and take a look at this it's an inhaler all right so we're gonna go ahead and try to change this inhaler right now so this guy is actually drunk at work <laughs> This guy is actually drunk at work. Anyways, let's go ahead and install this thing. Alrighty guys, we're gonna go ahead and jump straight to lspdfr.com so that we can go ahead and get this breathalyzer right now. I'm gonna go ahead and leave the link in the description and you're gonna go ahead and download this file right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and go to download and of course you're gonna go ahead and get uh, Go ahead and press download again you're gonna go ahead and get the two folders right now uh i'm actually installing this for the first time so i would rather you actually skip all the way to the end of this video to see if it actually works or not before you can go ahead and install it and uh, i'm gonna advise you to download both of these files right here because one of them this very uh this one right here does have the readme and this one right here does not have the readme in it so i'm gonna go ahead and install the breathalyzer 2.00 right here so i downloaded both files so i'm gonna go ahead and see which one actually works all right so with that said i actually have these two files downloaded right now so this one is the top file that you need to download that does have the readme so i'm gonna go ahead and open it up as you can see the readme is right here and this file right here actually just have the files so these are the files that i'm gonna install first and then later if this uh, this video could be a, a short one or it could be a long one depending on whether this one actually works or not but we're gonna need to go ahead and jump back into the game and see if this actually works right here all right so for this one with the uh with the readme i'm just gonna go ahead and open up the readme all right and then i'm gonna go ahead and close this file right here and then for for this one without the readme right here i'm gonna go ahead and open it and then i'm gonna go ahead and unzip the files just like so all right so with that said let me go ahead and close this and uh, let me go ahead and see if i can keep this readme as small as possible so that we can go ahead and see the pathway and i'm gonna go ahead and leave this right here and what i'm gonna open up now is our open iv so you're gonna need to open up your open iv all right let me go ahead and open this up here real quick and then we're gonna go ahead and install these files right here all right and for both of them i would rather since i'm actually doing this for the first time i'm going to go ahead and create another folder on my desktop where i'm just gonna go ahead and extract some of the files that we're going to be replacing just in case i'm not satisfied i'm going to go ahead and put um put back whatever uh was the original files in the game all right so you're going to go ahead and go to um mods right here so if you don't have these files right here when you open up your mods folder uh let me go ahead and go back over here <clears throat> you're going to go ahead and see these files just on this column right here um go ahead and go back over here so these files are just gonna be right here on this column right here so you're gonna go ahead and click whichever one that we need to navigate to on this readme right here and for instance if we need like uh 64f that rpf right here i'm gonna go ahead and click this one right here and then you're gonna go ahead and open up your uh edit mode just like so and you should get this banner right here uh advising you to have this in your mods folder so go ahead and 
<clears throat> and open it on your mask folder just like so all right i already have it on my mask folder so i don't need to uh do that right now so as you can see if i open up my mask folder i do have all of these files in here so if you watched my uh tutorial on how to install lspdfr you should have all of this uh stuff in here inside your mask folder all right so with that said let's go ahead and install our first one so let me go ahead and move this over here um all right let me go ahead and do this here real quick so that you can see probably we, ju we just need the name right now so i'm gonna go ahead and leave this right here on top of my readme so that i can actually see what the hell is going on all right so for the first one as you can see we're gonna need to go to this pathway but i need to go to this path let me go ahead and make this a little bit bigger like that all right and then uh go ahead and open up this file and then i'm just gonna go ahead and leave it like this right here i think you can see the pathway you can see the files that we need to install all right but before i can go ahead and do that i'm gonna go ahead and go to my desktop here real quick i'm gonna open up my file explorer i'm gonna go ahead and go to my desktop and let me go ahead and enlarge this for now i'm gonna go ahead and create a new file I'm just gonna go ahead and, and name this one replace all right replace just like this and i'm gonna go ahead and extract the original files into this replace file right here all right i did not even spell replace properly but whatever let me go ahead and close this all right so now let's go ahead and go to the first pathway right here once again <laughs> so the first pathway we're gonna be uh installing this uh prop inhaler um underscore zero one right here so we're gonna be installing this on this first pathway right here all right so let's go ahead and um and do just that so i'm gonna go ahead and um go back here we're gonna go ahead and go to mods 64 uh, i mean 64 c uh, all right 64c so 64c should be around here so it should be go ahead open up this file 64c and then we're going to go ahead and go to levels go to gta 5 all right and then we're going to go ahead and go to uh all right um what is that props right here and then we're going to go ahead and go to lav underscore des so les lav underscore des is going to right here and then we're gonna go ahead and go to v underscore minigame app dot rpf so it's gonna be this one right here all right <clears throat> so we're gonna go ahead and open up all of these files right here so right now we are replacing this prop underscore inhaler uh underscore zero one so i'm gonna go ahead and come to the top over here uh and then i'm gonna go ahead and search for prop all right prop underscore underscore inhaler just like that all right as you can see we do have our prop inhaler right here all right so it's gonna be this one let me go ahead and open it up and see what the hell is going on with this so this will be the inhaler that we are replacing right now all right so let me go ahead and close this and then i'm gonna go ahead and drag and drop this you know what before i can drag and drop this let me go ahead and uh extract this file all right um gonna go ahead and extract this file and i'm gonna replace put it on my desktop on this replace file right here that i <laughs> i did not spell properly just in case i need to put back these files uh i need the original files i'm gonna go ahead and put them in there all right so i'm gonna go ahead and select that as you can see if i open up this replace file we do have this file in here so this one will be the original file so if you want to go ahead and keep the original file you can go ahead and follow what i just did right there all right so now we are actually free to actually modify this so i'm gonna go ahead and drag and drop this file right here and then we're going to go ahead and open it up and see what the hell is going on in here so this will be the inhaler that we are replacing right here all right um you know what maybe this will be a good thing 
to actually go go ahead and try to install the other file here real quick all right and see what the difference is between um the breathalyzer 2.00 and the actually original one all right so give me guys give me a second while i minimize this for right now all right so yeah like i said this is a trial and error so we don't we need this file right here so let me go ahead and unzip this file right now all right hopefully you guys don't get confused with what's going on here so the pathway is pretty much the same all right for this one right here so the pathway is the same so now let me go ahead and uh, drag and drop this one this might be a different inhaler or something like that i don't know i'm finding this out right now so let me go ahead and drop this file right here and then we're gonna go ahead and open it up and see what it looks like so i guess we're gonna go ahead and change roots because this looks different this looks nicer than the one i just installed first all right the breathalyzer two point uh what is it 2.00 i'm gonna go ahead and uh install the original file all right so let me go ahead and close this so let me go ahead and just keep this file right now the one with the readme remember now we are in uh, on this one with the readme right here so with that said uh let me go ahead and close uh let me go ahead and close this one right here i know this is gonna look a little bit confusing so that's the reason why <laughs> i'm the guinea pig and you're gonna go ahead and get the right stuff all right so this one is the one that we installed first so i'm gonna go ahead and delete this uh let me just make sure i'm actually deleting that other let me close my edit mode right now let me go ahead and delete that file right here all right so what this means right now all right so what this means right now we're gonna go back to the web over here so when you are downloading this go ahead and download this file and with the file that you're gonna need to download for the breathalyzer that i just installed right now the one that looks pretty nice is gonna be for this one right here so you're gonna need to download this one if you want the one uh the one that i have right now or if you want the old one you can go ahead and download this file right here all right so this one with the readme is the one that i like that i'm gonna install and this one without the readme i don't want this one all right so let me go ahead and close this all right so now that you have that information um let me go ahead and oh, where is that readme all right let me go ahead and open up that readme all right so now that we can go ahead and continue with the installation all right so now we are done with the first one with the first line right here all right so now we're gonna go ahead and copy uh and replace this right here it's gonna be p underscore inhaler underscore zero one all right so we're gonna go ahead and go to two pathways for this one so the first one is gonna be this pathway and then the second one is gonna be this pathway replacing the same thing all right so with that said mm, let's go ahead and do just that all right so on my left hand side right here i'm on my gtf i mean uh, <clears throat> i'm on my open iv <clears throat> i'm gonna go ahead and go to mods just like that make sure you um check out the name that you just searched for so now we are on this pathway right here all right if i go back over here i'm gonna be at uh a gta5 and then i'm gonna go to mods all right so now we're gonna go ahead and look for the second path with the first um first of the two pathways that, that we need to go to all right so this one is gonna be x64d all right so x64d we're gonna go ahead and open this one up and we're gonna need to go to levels all right gta5 um genetic right there all right and then uh cut objects right here open this one up all right and then we're gonna go ahead and replace the p underscore inhaler underscore zero one all right so let me go ahead and open up my um edit menu and then i'm gonna go ahead and search for this one right here so that we can see what the hell is going on with that all right so i'm gonna go ahead and say p underscore inhaler all right 
so you're gonna go ahead and get the p underscore inhaler underscore zero one so that's the one that we want right here so let me go ahead and open it up and see what it looks like as you can see is still the inhaler that we are trying to replace all right so before i replace this i'm gonna go ahead and right click extract all right into that same file right here that's on my uh desktop i'm gonna go ahead and replace and uh, extract this file from right there all right so if i open it up now i should have at least two files in there all right as you can see i do have two files in there so just in case i need to replace everything to original i have the files uh to replace that with all right so now that we are here let's go ahead <clears throat> let's go ahead and take this file right here the p underscore inhaler underscore zero one we're gonna go ahead and drag and drop this file right here all right as you can see let's go ahead and open it up and see what it looks like so this will be our in uh, <clears throat> our breathalyzer right here all right so we're gonna go ahead and test this out in game so don't worry about that all right so let me go ahead and close this now we're gonna go ahead and go to the second um waypoint that we need to replace the same file at all right so let me go ahead and close this at the top i'm gonna go back to the mods over here so now we're gonna go ahead and go to x64g all right so it'll be x64g rpf right here go ahead and open this up we're gonna go to levels gta5 genetics and then after genetics we're gonna go to cut uh cut objects right here all right so it'll be the first one cut objects gonna go ahead and open this one up and of course i'm gonna go ahead and search for what i'm looking for to make sure i'm replacing the uh the right file all right underscore inhaler just like that as you can see if we open this one up right here it's gonna be the default inhaler right here all right um i already have it um i already have it on this file on this replace file right here all right as you can see it's right there so all i need to do now let's go ahead and take this one uh right here i'm just gonna drag and drop this file right here all right it might take a few seconds or something like that let's see hopefully this this is not going to break <laughs> my game right here anyways taking a while but it's right there now let's go ahead and open it up it should be the same thing all right so there you go so you should have this in game all right but we're gonna find out whether that's true or not anyways now we are done with two of these files right here all right so now we're gonna go ahead and install this one the ng underscore proc underscore inhaler all right so the pathway for that one uh let me see here so the pathway for this one is going to be uh let me go ahead and uh take out the search over here and then we're gonna go back to mods just like so you should be over here now all right so for this one we're gonna go to mods x uh x64g is that that the same pathway that we no that's a different pathway all right so we're gonna go back to 64g all right go to levels gta5 genetics but now we're gonna go to proc ob object right here uh, pf all right so it's going to be this one at the very bottom right here all right did not match this right here so let's go ahead and open up the bottom one and of course i'm gonna go ahead and search for that uh ng all right underscore inhaler just like that am i missing something here or oh it's proc underscore inhaler all right let's go ahead and erase this just go ahead and try a proc underscore inhaler just like so all right so i'm gonna go ahead and open this one up here real quick as you can see we still have the same um default inhaler right here all right so i'm gonna go ahead and close this and like i said i'm gonna go ahead and keep the originals 
extract this file right here i'm gonna go ahead and send it to my uh replace file and now we should have three original files that we just installed right now remember one of them this one we install it in two places but it's still the same file right and then you can see now i do have three files right here these are the default files right here all right so now that i'm done with that i'm gonna go ahead and drag and drop this one right here might take a few seconds as well mm. might take a few seconds and there it is go ahead and open this up all right so there it is right here the replaced file right here all right so now that i'm done with that i'm gonna go ahead and close this i think we are done all right i think we are done so i'm gonna go ahead and close this i'm gonna go ahead and close the readme go ahead and close my edit mode go to file close all archives all right go ahead and take out the search um word over there so you should be on this page go ahead and close um your open iv and i'm gonna go ahead and keep this file this is my original files right here i'm gonna go ahead and delete these files right here and then we're gonna go ahead and jump into the game here real quick and check out our new breathalyzer prop let's get it Alrighty, guys now that we are in the game we're gonna go ahead and find a guinea pig to test this on i think this guy right here wait one second you wanna you wanna, you wanna go ahead and stop for me sir all right so i'm gonna go ahead and in initiate um a breathalyzer on this guy and uh let's see if uh what we just installed actually works all right so let me go ahead and do a first person view so that we can go ahead and take a look at his stupid face just right all right you've been drinking sir huh you've been drinking anyways let's go ahead and do a breathalyzer test on this guy all right let's see if our prop change there it is right there all right so if you want to have that prop or uh, in your game right there you're gonna go ahead and do what i just did all right let me go ahead and do it again just in case you did not catch that all right let's go ahead and test this boy you've been drinking Thank sir <laughs> anyways guys as you can see it does actually work all right so it does actually work so if this video helped you out to install this breathalyzer prop right here make sure you are smashing that like button on the video subscribe to the channel if you are new and please please do comment down below because i would love to know whether this helped you out or not all right and of course guys i'm trying to reach a thousand subscribers so one what does it say one apple a day keeps a daughter a doctor away well i say one subscriber a day gets me closer to that 1000 so get subscribing anyways guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys on the next episode